Welcome to our conference, Morals and Machines. We need radical ideas that bring us into a better future. It's the controversies of our times. You are asking these questions and we are happy and grateful to open up this church for this kind of discussion. Today, we want to look at the concept of hybridity in terms of human-machine collaboration and coexistence. There is no such thing as neutral data. We cannot even begin to address the biases that can exist in our systems without thinking about them at a systems level. We don't want representation, we want power. I define myself as a cyborg artist. I, I close my eyes and I feel that I go deeper and deeper on the earth and then I have like roots under my feet that are, are across all over the, the earth and through those roots I can reach and, and feel the vibrations. Whether or not we use cryptographic means and how we use them uh, makes the difference whether we create a freedom machine or a control machine. Jede Technologie, die wir in der Menschheitsgeschichte entwickelt haben, kann zum Guten gebraucht werden und sie kann missbraucht werden. What happens when we delegate decisions to machines? And what if we don't like the outcome? Wir arbeiten dafür, dass Perspektiven möglich sind, dass sich Menschen verwirklichen können. Das ist unsere Aufgabe. Our job by definition is to think about what does this mean in a socio-technical system. Hat der Mensch die Sache in der Hand? Das müssen wir im Blick haben und da müssen wir Maßstäbe setzen. Imagine how the future of an algorithmic world might look like. What morals will be in place? I'm deeply convinced that within a couple of years it will be illegal to make a diagnosis without additionally consulting an AI. There's a whole raft of uh, technology that already today allows us to manage the system as complex as it is. Wir brauchen sehr viel Bildung. Wenn wir neue Technologien haben, dann müssen wir eine zumindest kritische Menge der Bevölkerung auch in die Lage versetzen, zu verstehen, was da eigentlich abläuft.